22 innocent victims killed at a pop concert. Many more were seriously injured. The bomb exploded in the Manchester Arena in 2017. But for many families, it feels like yesterday. 32-year-old Kelly Brewster died in the attack. Her sister Claire was injured. Today, she told the court, all our hearts are broken. It seems cruel that her life has been cut short. My dad will never walk his daughter down the aisle. My mum will never take her shopping for a wedding dress. 17-year-old Chloe Rutherford and her boyfriend Liam Curry also died in the blast. Today, Chloe's mum said, losing Chloe is a physical pain that never leaves us. There is always an empty chair where she should be. All I wanted to do was make sure she was safe. Liam's mum told the court, you took from me something more precious than gold, a beautiful boy inside and out. All we have now is heartbreak and dreams of what we should have had. Is it fair to say that what Salman did has come, come as a complete shock to you? Yes. Hashem Abedi told police he knew nothing of his brother Salman's plot, but prosecutors said he was jointly responsible and in March, he was convicted of 22 murders. Many of the relatives broke down in tears as they read out their statements, but Hashem Abedi was not in court to hear them. The judge said he was brought here by prison officers, but refused to come into the room. 18-year-old Georgina Callender was also killed. Her father said, I walk the streets at night because I can't go out in the day because everyone wants to come up and talk out of the goodness of their hearts. But I don't want to talk. I want to die. So many families, so much grief. Hashem Abedi will be sentenced tomorrow. Leila Hayes, 5 News.